In this video, I will demonstrate how to change the hostname ControlM Server uses to identify itself when communicating with the agents. During product installation, the ControlM Server hostname, which is used to interact with other ControlM products, is entered here. It may sometimes be necessary to change the hostname assigned to ControlM Server to work with the fully qualified name or a virtual hostname. The new hostname must resolve to an IP address on the machine where ControlM Server is running and can be contacted by all agents connected to that ControlM Server. The hostname assigned to ControlM is defined in the parameter local IP host interface name. This can be found in ControlM CTM menu, parameter customization, basic communication. In this case, my ControlM server is assigned the host name VLTLVCUSEU02 and its value is stored in variable OS underscore PRM underscore hostname. <laughs> Depending on the operating system, this information is stored in the config.dat file in the data directory if it's Unix or Linux, or in the case of Windows, it's stored in the registry path in the location indicated on the screen now. After changing the value of this parameter in CTM menu as shown, you must stop and restart the ControlM server for the change to take effect. But before doing that, you should update the field authorized ControlM servers in all agents to the new hostname. You can do this from the ControlM Configuration Manager as shown. And once all those changes are made, you can start the ControlM server to begin working with this new name. Thank you for watching this video out of the Workload Automation Support video series. Please check our YouTube channel or Knowledge Base for more videos like this.